Got a 2022 CF Moto 3 US uh, 650. Today we're doing an oil change. I got it up on the rear sands, probably incorrectly, as you can tell from me fucking up my shit. And also, uh, yeah, those are some good, uh, what do you call it, uh, spindles. So, I started off from uh, taking this, uh, seems to be 18 millimeter, millimeter bolt out of this drain right here. I also got the, the thing tapped right here. Right here is the original CF Moto uh, OEMs filter. Uh, there's a lot of, uh, you know, issues on which filter you can use for the 2022 um, CF Moto uh, Adventure Tour. And I would say go OEM for now. You know, I got a whole bunch of other filters and shit, but, you know, we'll see. So I'm just going to let this drain. Yeah, obviously it's metallic as so hell. I'll get my magnet in a second. We can check it out. So the oil's almost done dripping out. I'm about to replace the OEM filter with OEM filter right here. Uh, if you don't know where to get it, go on CF Moto's website. They'll ship it to you. I got it in three days because I was in a pinch. Um, this is the oil that uh, is, you know, the one that we should get. That's what the manufacturer specified. The stupid, you know, with the ester formula, APS plus JOSA MA2. It's just a certification because this oil gets ran pretty hard, I assume. Um, I did my homework and uh, I am gonna replace this even though I could just, you know, uh, burn it and drop it in oil. I guess I did my homework and got some M12 copper 12 millimeters. Yeah, that was a fucking guess, but it seems to be the same size, so that's a pretty fucking cool. Alright, so I got my. <sighs> Alright, so I'm gonna try to break loose this uh, oil filter right here. I got me some pliers, you know what I mean? We're gonna try to see what happens. Uh, I think I'm gonna go back with it, I believe. Righty, tidy, lefty, loosey down. I don't know. One sec. Righty, tidy, lefty, loosey. I gotta go down. I see we're moving nice. No problem. Hope I ain't tightening it. I don't think so, I am. I don't think I am. I think I'm doing the right way. Oh yeah, we are. Oh yeah, this is easy, huh? This is my uh, 600 mile break-in oil change. So, and yes, I've done many oil changes before. Many, many, many on my truck and stuff, but this is my first time doing it on my motorcycle. I've done it on my moped, but it's pretty easy. So we're just gonna let that come out. <sighs> there we go. This is the filter that comes out of it. You'll never find it. Alright, shit's been draining for a bit. You know, these these look fine. These look good together. This shit's still drooping. It says a total of 2.6 completely dry. I don't know. We're just gonna guess, I guess. Because, uh, you know, who got time for measurements and shit? <laughs> I know what I'm saying. And you know I don't have a filter. You know I don't have a fucking, what do you call it? Uh funnel. Yeah, like some bitch in it. Anyway, give me a sec. So, I already uh, oiled up the o-ring. I'm gonna put it in dry. You know, actually I'm gonna put a little bit inside of it. Shit some giggles. Hold up. I'm gonna put a little bit inside. You guys may be mad at me, but I threaded on the new one. Super easy it went on, buddy. Super easy. You don't need to you don't need to do it that tight. Honestly, you don't even need to put a wrench to it usually. It's probably too tight now, you know what I'm saying? But <laughs> I heard some horror stories, so uh, definitely make sure this is tight. <sighs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I put a little bit of oil inside that thing, like maybe a quarter, because it'll just pour out. So now I'm gonna, I don't even know. I'm just gonna try to put this stuff inside, you know, while well, my dog. My dog and my girlfriend over here. Let's see how this goes. You feel better now? Can you... So, I'm back at it. Putting oil in. Very, very slightly. It all went away. My oil, I don't know where it went. 
Whatever. <laughs> it literally just disappeared. Whatever. I'll come back maybe. Maybe it went somewhere else to the engine. There it is again. There you go. Hi, oil. You see it? This is how I'm pouring, like, pouring it in. I felt my funnel. Oh, yeah, you like that. That's a waste. Don't, don't hate, just appreciate. Alright, I'm gonna do desperate shit. It's freezing out. <sighs> yeah, so this is my process right here. Alright. Don't hate. I mean, this thing has, what, 3.75, yeah, so, I still got a little bit to go, you know, uh, I still got a little bit to go, you see, like, the oil disappeared, this is just a fucking leak, and make sure your fucking shit's on, you know, your bolt, we're gonna try to not spill half of it, oh, don't mind that, We're on the side stand, right? We're not on the side stand right now, so. Eventually, after I'm done, I'll put on the side stand. I'll let the engine run. When I believe there's enough oil in it, so it doesn't grenade itself, so. I'll do this for a little bit. I'll be back. Well, we finished the oil change, guys. Everything went smoothly. My phone died in the middle of the fucking video like 10 times. Um, but it's here, um, I'll show you, this is when it's, I have to park it over here in the street because I live in the city, it's Halloween night, I put a level, looks like it's empty right, I put a level, bada boom bada bing, it's a little cold tonight as you can tell, you know, just put it in a spot where you usually bring it, and if it ain't, if it ain't happy with what it looks like, just tip the bike over more, <laughs> towards you. All right, that was a successful CF Moto thing. It's nothing's leaking. That's just dripping off the crankcase. Everything looks good, you know. I the crush wash is crushed. I gotta put the bracket back on. That's easy though. Here's the filter. Um, I went with the OEM because I didn't fuck around with that shit. Make sure that shit's tight. You know. Well, you know. Good rest of your night. You know what I'm saying. And uh, watch out, guys, for the Can 303. And the uh, KN177 filter. Um, I wouldn't use it for 2022 uh, 650 CF Motos. Um, it seems to be that CF Motos filters vary all throughout the brands. <laughs> so be careful, you know. See, like I told you, I wasn't fucking around. I got that one right there, KN303. Maybe if I get some likes, I'll compare it to my uh, stock one. Thank you guys for liking the video. Hope you guys have a good rest of your night. And uh, be safe.